Hello guys, this is Tasha Way. Welcome to my channel. This is going to be the first video on my channel and of course I would like to make it as an introduction video for you to know who I am, where I'm living and what I'm doing in my life and so on. So, first of all, um, after watching this video don't forget to put a like and subscribe to the channel and don't forget to put an alarm to not to miss all the videos. So, yeah, let's start first from the coffee. <laughs> well, first words about myself. My name is Natasha. I am 24 years old and I'm from Belarus. But, you know, the life is bring me there to the city of China, Cook, Shenzhen. Uh, I'm a model and I've been modeling already more than five years. I've started my way in 2016 uh, in Belarus in a model school. Then model school just noticed me, saw some, you know, model qualities and so on. And they like uh, give me some pushing, you know, some agencies like they see that uh, some potential in me that I can become a model and stuff. So they decided to send me to China for becoming a model and so on. So traveled all around China. I've been to Beijing, I've been to Shanghai, I've been to Hangzhou, to really beautiful cities there. And I can say that all of them are really beautiful, but for me, one of the best ones is still uh, stays Shenzhen. And this is the place actually where I am living right now. And as you see, uh, now is uh, 20 of January and still it's so warm, it's so sunny, so you know, amazing weather, amazing place, very greeny one as you can see in uh, winter even. So yeah, why not to live right there? I would like to say that, uh, well, when first I come to the city, it wasn't so nice to me because uh, when I first arrived there, it was super hot. It was May, it was uh, 2018 year here because one year I was traveling all around China and now, like 2018, I came over to Shenzhen and it was summertime. In summer here, uh, the temperature, you know, something like Dubai weather, something like that is super hot. Uh, because Shenzhen is located in the south of China, like the most southern part there. Um, I think not the most one, but one of them. It's very close to Hong Kong also, and because we have the sea around there, uh, that's why I have a huge community and stuff. So, you know, it was really hot. And I wasn't that successful there and uh, well my trip here was not really nice but what I fell in love with the city is about uh, people, about how clean is it, you know, walking in the Shenzhen you will not see any rubbish in the streets, you will not see people, you know, like drunk stuff or something like that. Well, a lot of intelligent people were very polite ones and so on. And uh, let's be honest, Shenzhen is one of the cities like which is have a lot of young people there, or you know, who are mostly working, earning money here, trying to make some business. Well, it's not city like you know, very traditional cities like Beijing or uh, like for example, even Shanghai. Like Shanghai still is like you know a little bit western one, but for me Shanghai is too big and Shanghai. I don't know, give me a feeling like not really Chinese city. Here in Shenzhen, I still feel I live like in China, but kind of modern one, you know, like modern China. That's why I love this kind, and it seems like very, very close to me and, uh, you know, to my character. So, what else to say is uh, maybe about my job, I guess. Like, as soon as I said I'm being a model and why I decided to stay there because, uh, you know, for all these years I got to know a lot of people who helped me through my job, who teach me a lot about modeling stuff because guys, modeling is not really easy job. I know for some people it seems like, oh, you guys wear dresses and uh, it's just uh, so nice and it's so beautiful and so on. But it's not that actually that fair as you say, because China is, you know, producing all the, uh, you know, 
and like the clothing of the products in the world so it's like uh, have a huge amount of goods right there so that's why they also need the models to shoot it right so I decided to stay there exactly and not travel all around the world because um, firstly I just you know love the place over there and as soon as I know some people there and I got some nice conditions slowly time by time so I decided like okay why not to stay there because it's a nice place and everything and for me also I don't really like cold cities even though I'm from Belarus and Belarus is like not really warm country uh, most uh, time of the year is pretty cold and the stuff but for me still from the childhood I've been very you know easy to sick or something like that so for me to have this nice weather very shiny very sunny one for me this is the best option I'm gonna share with you guys about my plans for the future um, you know I'm also doing TikTok and I started to do YouTube um, I hope also I'm gonna start uh, some Twitch streams in the future but uh, you know I wish I could not just become like some model I would like to also become a person who can bring some nice uh, content to the people I wouldn't say like oh I would like to be a famous blogger or something like that I guess it's not what I want to become but uh, how to say, I would like to help people, I would like to, you know, be a person who can bring people smiles, bring people some interest, and for sure, uh, in my future videos in my channel, I would like to show you guys, uh, you know, how the China looks like, especially the Shenzhen, because as far as I know, Shenzhen is not uh, the city which everyone knows, you know, like most of the people, uh, they know Beijing, they know Shanghai, right, Hong Kong, but most people don't even hear about Shenzhen, but Shenzhen is an amazing city, I promise you guys, and I'm gonna show it in my future videos, so, you know, you can make sure you can come there uh, for your vacation, maybe, or something like that, and just I hope my videos can bring some nice vibe to you. Um, what else? Well, as I said, I've been five years in this city, uh, I went through a lot of things, honestly. I mean, from the nicest times, like uh, I'm talking about 2018, 19 year before COVID time, and it was really amazing because everything was so open. And as far as I already mentioned, um, Shenzhen is located very close to Hong Kong. And before, we literally can travel every day from Shenzhen to Hong Kong or from Shenzhen to Morocco. It was just super normal. But uh, as soon as COVID came, well, we went through a lot of, uh, you know, not super pleasant stuff like lockdowns, strict measures and stuff. But thanks God, it's already passed and you know, free life back again. And for me, really, I'm always been happy to, you know, just to be free in your actions and what you're gonna wear or whenever you wanna go. I think it's so much important. But also, I would say that uh, this time it's changed uh, people and the, the city in general um, well anyway I hope in the shortest time some will bring some new businesses back and uh, bring some nice vibe as it's always been but still even though through these little problems as I said uh, Shenzhen is still one of the really most beautiful cities you have to visit so yeah check about Shenzhen and uh, while I'm there don't forget to subscribe put an alarm to my videos so you can't miss the ones and well in general I also would like to show you not only Shenzhen but maybe some cities of China our cuisine what we are eating how we are living there so mostly we'll share some uh, daily lifestyle for you so if you like uh, daily lifestyle vlogs so you know maybe this account for you so yeah guys, I guess it was a nice video, I really was glad to talk to you and I hope you all had a nice time with me, thank you so much for watching, see you!